good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. We have already started here. So this is round two between these two sides who have already met once this season. Forward it goes. And that's been levered clear. Dynamo Moscow are just so strong away from home, yet to lose on opposition territory. And out to safety. That will be a corner. They've played it short. Played into the middle, up to meet it! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. I wonder what you've seen, Jim, over the early moments of the game. Well, I think both teams probably feel it's, it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. Neustetter. the match or thereabouts gone and we still await the first goal plays it out to the wing lovely bit of skill there knocks one in great leap hits it again but still no joy how hard can it be to time the jump with the right contact it's not that difficult is it Hoists it forward. Has ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Sunic. Philip. Over to the left. Gorgeous control there. Time to deliver. comes the cross and it's hoisted clear Dinamo Moscow have been pretty good down that left side you know no doubt this is an area they've identified as a potential weakness in their opposition and they're willing to exploit it well the defense have two choices deal with the man or, or deal with the space questions were asked but he's given the answers to get it forward quickly he's making good use of his strength there just refuses to be out muscled it's a very good battle there terrific to watch Philip
be a throw in. And it's Neustetter. The ball has crossed the line and it's a throw. And it's played forward. Can't get the better of his opposite number. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. And he's won a corner. Gets up to head it! but not by that far. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Philip. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Can he deliver? Aimed in towards the centre. Philip with a shot! Is it out of harm's way? In the mark. Half time. So now the team has broken through. That's something up for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. So we reached the halfway point. Dinamo Moscow ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. An engrossing half but we're still where we started, nil-nil. So we're already into the second period. Dinamo Moscow playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Forward it goes. That looks a good ball. Up for a throw. And there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Dashing forward at pace. Tries to get it forward quickly. Philip. He's left his man. A chance to play it in. And he's got and they've been caught out here. Hoists it forward. Gets wrestled off the ball. And he's made sure that that won't get through. And it's played forward. Well, it's a safety in numbers approach to defending here. Yeah, but dropping deep can bring more trouble, yeah? 
Well, shots from distance and, and space in wider positions, besides the obvious issue of inviting most of your opposition high up the pitch. A really good feat from him. It's well blocked, and back out it comes. Forward it goes. Done very well to intervene. Neustetter tries to get it forward quickly up towards the front line cuts it out Philip lovely bit of skill it's being played forward oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger That's nice. There are a few waiting for it. Philip. Philip! And he's there to make a great save. Philip simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here, I think. Massive leap! Harmlessly behind. I think he deserves credit for, for getting something away, given that he had to contend with a, a double dose of closing down. Pull forward. Oh, good interception. Sunic. Neustetter. Hoists it forward. Well, that's where he wants it. And it's played forward. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Philip! Hits one! Oh, great save, real class. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Changes then in quick succession. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift. Dinamo Moscow showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Good challenge, he just stood firm. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Has he found his man? He's gone out of play. So here comes the substitution. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. More than happy to take the muscular approach. We are into stoppage time. Philip, big 
chance! Oh, that was no routine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. And it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. Little craft or guile or penetration. Defences largely untroubled. It's goals. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Yeah, this looked the most likely outcome, but we've had a, a good variety in this game, despite it being anticlimactic. So many thanks to Jim. Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. We have already started here. So this is round two. That's clear cut. It's a free kick. to get it forward quickly and the through ball is intercepted Zenit St Petersburg have been very strong away from home still to lose on the road Malcolm Forward it goes. Oh, well played, he saw that coming. There are a few waiting for it. Oh, that looks a foul. Yeah, referee's given it. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Keeper's ball. Hoists it forward.
He's played him through. Shapes the shoot! Goal! Zenit St. Petersburg! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Zenit St. Petersburg take the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Malcolm. Asmoon. And it's played forward. Uh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Asmoon, Zenit St. Petersburg are seeing a lot of the ball and have a 1-0 lead to show for it. Asmoon! Out of play for a goal kick. Malcolm, hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Lovely bit of skill there. Can he deliver? Oh, sweet feet. Hoists it forward. Ivanovic positions himself well and cuts it out. Get a throw in. Uh, it's a poor throw that, picked off with relative ease. Has he found his man? Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Forward it goes. Juba. And that's sprayed out wide. Ball's gone out of play. He's got away. Chance! Oh, that was no routine save. Ziuba simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Malcolm plays it short. Here's the delivery. And that has put paid to that. Rakitsky. Asmoon. Going for goal. Oh, that is asking for trouble. the whistle for half time so there you have it a close fought half of football but Robert still had its moments but ultimately produced just one goal a more than decent game up to now
Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Zenit and Petersburg, the happier of the teams, heading in for half-time, 1-0 up. And the second half gets on the way. Zenit and Petersburg carrying a one-goal lead. Malcolm tries to get it forward quickly, and he just whacks it away. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. So who's he picking out? Look at the goal! on it Asmoon Asmoon truthfully it was hard to see any better outcome there hoists it forward Battles to win it back. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Malcolm. Ivanovic plays it forward. The referee's awarded a free kick. Ivanovic is there, and he can get that clear. And it's played forward. That is terrific skill. Has a hit! A real chance and a real let-off. Oh, it was the first touch to die for, and it set him up beautifully. Ivanovic goes looking. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them show the ambition and adventure to go further ahead. But it seems as if they settled for a, a riskier approach now to defend this. Out towards the flank. And he's cut it out. Forward it goes. To locate someone up front the message is clear none shall pass Malcolm tries to get it forward quickly defending of the desperate variety
Zenit St. Petersburg are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Now the counter. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honor shift. Smolnikov. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Plays it out wide. Well, the less said about that pass, the better. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Rakitsky. So holding on now for those three precious points. That's a promising ball. He's gone for it! Oh, and that should have been two. Asmun really did let them off the hook. They could have wrapped it all up. Zenit St. Petersburg making another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Two minutes to be added on. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. And that is that. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, to me, this is a result, Peter, that says an awful lot more than the score.